Get ready to face Mega Sableye in Pokemon Go. Yes, Mega Sableye is back to Pokemon Go and in this video, we will break down everything you need to know to master these raids, including the best counters, shiny odds and more. Mega Sableye will be making a comeback in Mega Raids from October 14 to October 28. Don't miss the 14th day opportunity to catch this Mega Pokemon. You can find a perfect IV Mega Sableye with 843 CP at level 20 with no weather boost and at level 25 with 1054 CP on fog weather boost. The shiny rates for Mega Sableye in raids is generally estimated to be around 1 in 20. How to get a Mega Sableye? It's important to note that you can't catch Mega Sableye directly from the raid. The raid boss will always appear in its base form. To obtain Mega Sableye, you will need to collect 100 Mega Energy. After your first Mega Evolution, you won't need Mega Energy to evolve that Pokemon again. You can earn Mega Energy by completing Mega Sableye raids and by walking a Mega Sableye as your buddy. Is Mega Sableye worth using? Unfortunately, not really. Mega Sableye low attack and overall stats make it a fairly weak Pokemon in Pokemon Go. Its main use are for completing your Pokédex and providing a boost to your team in Dark or Ghost type rides. Resuming, Mega Sableye is pretty much useless in Pokémon GO. Mega Sableye is a Dark and Ghost ride boss with a weakness to Fairy type moves. Use a powerful Fairy type Pokémon to counter it effectively. A team of 2 to 5 trainers with strong high level Fairy type Pokémon can easily defeat Mega Sableye regardless of weather conditions. If you are a low level trainer or have a low level counters, consider joining a group to increase your Pokemon's power. As always, we will break the best counters by Pokemon farms. Start with Megas, Mega Rayquaza, just because this Pokemon is a monster, Mega Gardevoir, Primal Groudon, Primal Kyogre, Origin Dialga and Mega Gengar. Moving into Shadow Ones, Shadow Gardevoir, Shadow Groudon, Shadow Kyogre, Shadow Grand Bull, Shadow Usury, Shadow Excadrill. Finally, the regular ones Circuitry, Down Wings and Krozma, Zacian, Tapu Bulu, and Tapu Coco, and Enamorus. So, trainers, what do you think of Mega Sablai? In my opinion, it's only good for the decks and the shiny decks, since I really like the colors of Mega Sablai. I hope this guide was helpful. Thank you for watching.